Can you put Joseph in? Yay, Luke! Good setting up the nativity. Oh, put the card in there. The it's Vlogmas, Vlogmas, and it's time to celebrate! A puzzle. A puzzle? What? Yeah, but you want a 500 piece puzzle, a 100 piece puzzle? I want a Wentworth one. A wooden one? <laughs> a Wentworth wooden puzzle. Wow. We need, you, know. <laughs> you asked for specifics. <laughs> Vlogmas! Good morning, everyone. You say good morning? Good morning. It is not quite sunrise yet, and I'm being very quiet because everyone else in the house is asleep. But Luke decided to wake up. So Jessica nursed him for a little bit while I took a shower. And now I'm up with Luke, and we're just gonna have an excellent morning. Little, little daddy Luke time. Anyway, today's gonna be really busy. We've got occupational therapy for Luke. We've got, uh, yeah. We've got music class today. The kids have a bunch of different classes, so I'm not really sure. I don't think we have like a Christmassy activity planned, but who knows? Who knows what we're gonna do? Oh, Jacob is doing a bunch of uh, cooking today. So he's gonna be baking some like cookies and things. So I'm excited to see what he comes up with there. You got any plans? Ziggy Zags? <laughs> You are doing music class today, so you get to do some ziggy zags. Ziggy zag, ziggy zag, ziggy zag, ziggy zag, zoom, zoom. Ziggy zag, ziggy zag, ziggy zag. Zoom, zoom. Ziggy zag, ziggy zag, ziggy zag, zoom, zoom. Ziggy zag, zoom all around that room. There's a little bunny in our yard today. Hello, bunny. I found this with some of the Christmas things in storage, so uh, I wanna see how Luke responds to it. <gasps> a camel. You like the camel? <gasps> a sheep. She goes, bah, bah. Okay, what else we got? Oh, a donkey. Is the donkey? palm tree and a little cart there you go. another little palm tree I think these connect Ooh. I think this is Joseph there you go. a little staple food basket and some wise men and an angel it's an angel angel and Mary and a donkey and a little baby little baby Jesus You like this toy? Is that a fun toy? Baby. Yay, Luke! Good job. Can you put the baby in? Yay, Luke! 
Whoops. Did the baby fall down? Whoops. Try again. Yay, Luke. Good job. Good putting baby Jesus in the manger. Good job. I'm going to hand it to Dad. Oh, you can put him in again? Yay. Can you put Mary in? Can you put Mary in? Yay, Luke. Can you put Joseph in? Can you put Joseph in? Yay, Luke. Good setting up the nativity. Oh, put the card in there. There you go. All right, we just finished our occupational therapy with Luke. Uh, today we were working on a lot of like oral things. So he was eating through most of it. She was checking how his jaw was moving and stuff like that. We also used his little vibrating mouth stimulator a little bit and worked on his cheeks and his molars. And then at the end, we had him practice taking off his socks because that's one of the milestones that we're working on for him. It was a really good session. And now it's time for us to get into music class. We've got a couple minutes between classes, which means we've got time for Advent. Hopefully, let's see if we can do it. Woo! Who's going first? Okay, Jacob's gonna go get everything and he's gonna bring Lukey's first. Oh my goodness. I know where number seven is. Oh, Lukey's looking for, oh, it's this teeny tiny one. You get it, Luke? Oh wait, that's seven? I thought you it was your the sticker? other one. I thought it was still out. Yeah, you did it! Hmm, Ooh. where does number seven go? Under there. the bridge, that's a fun place. Here, you wanna try again? Ooh. Yes. Oh, 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 oh that's oh, great! You wanna go smooch? Tap, Here we go. Tap, tap, tap. Tap, tap, tap. tap, tap, tap. Yay. Yay. You did it! I love how these wow. houses are you packed on top of You wanna see your house? See it's your a house? stacked house. Yeah, you've got a stacked house. This Ooh. is at the top. This is house. called House Moving Castle. This yeah. is a stacked house. Next up is Parker. <laughs> <laughs> um, it's up here. Ooh, in the stars by the moon. Maybe a moon. Uh, I love how they always have the second flat. Like the hardest thing. Ooh, some oh. gum drops. I don't think it's gum. I think it's chocolate. Excuse me, escape man. Excuse me. It might just be plain chocolate. I can't do it. Oh, there it is. You might be able to take a bite of that, but it's pretty tricky. Is it solid chocolate today? Yes. Yeah, how, how about this? If you want to share, you can hold your finger here and you take a bite. Bite really hard. Where's this guy? Where's this guy going? Nice. How was it? Thank, Thank you. you so Thank much. You're welcome. <laughs> Duncan's next. Yes! <laughs> Only like 
like a hundred days in the lab. Oh! Another! Whoa! Oh, it, says, it says right here there are 18 of those. So Duncan gets two. Okay, next is Mama. On your okay. mark. Good set. You ready for the sniff? Big sniff. <laughs> Big sniff. Oh, it smells so good. Kind of small. I wonder what this could be. Oh, it's such a cute little package. Cuticle cream. All right. Cuticle cream? Yeah, this is something I don't really use. <laughs> but hey, maybe it's time to start. Oh. It's what? cemented. Nope, I got it, I got it. It's so cute though. Like it's definitely cuticle cream. I don't know if this is like really the professional way of doing cuticle cream because it's not something I do. I've gotten a manicure a couple times. It's not really my thing, um, but that, that's when I think I've ever, like I've had this. It's like you go, <laughs> I, don't know, like, why would, I don't know why people would do this, but like. It's fun. <laughs> I honestly like I don't know why this product exists. Tell me if there's anybody at home that like regularly uses cuticle cream like at home use because I've never heard of that. I thought it was just kind of something that they did for fancies at manicure places. And if you do use it, how yes. do you use it? Because uh, we need some tutorials on our cuticle cream usage. <laughs> Ooh, looks like Parker's got it down. I, I, That's a lot of cuticle cream. Yeah. Oh, oh. Very right, nice, Duncan. very nice, Duncan. So how I did it is I rubbed them on my fingers right over my cubicle, and then I had extra, so I just rubbed my hands. Yeah, you just use it like lotion, I think. Number seven. I did it. Ooh, it's another graphic pic. It's got a picture of a guitar, and it says, without music, life would be flat. We love a dad joke. B flat. B flat. Like the note B flat. Flat. See? Without music life would be flat. <laughs> that's a Christmas tree. Christmas tree. Christmas tree. Mm, it's right by the Christmas deer. Tree. I think it'll be a deer. I think a fish. A fish? <laughs> yes. Yeah. It will be a fish. Yeah, I think it'll be a fish. Too. Like it looked fish shaped, but that's such a funny thing to be in an advent. Home. No, just kidding. I think it's either a fish or an angel. This one, Jake. Is this the Musa chocolate? Musa chocolate. Hey. Mm. I bet that's gonna be so good, Jacob. Yeah. <laughs> Sad, bite. Sad bite. Gotta get in there. Is the outside the best part? Okay, he's, he's almost there. Keep digging. <laughs> I think you're you're in it. It's just chocolate. <laughs> How is it, Duncan? Thank you. It's really good. Thank you. Mm, that is amazing. Is this your new favorite, Jake? Yeah. And Luke's having scrambled eggs. All right. Happy Advent, everybody. Let's get back to our very busy day. Yeah. Jacob's in a cooking class right now. I think he's making oatmeal M&M cookies. Very exciting. Jacob's taking two different cooking classes today, and he always makes the most delicious things from this cooking class. He's made like a meat spaghetti that was delicious. He's made a bunch of stuff from like Hamilton's time. He made a bunch of like Disney things, like the gray stuff. It's delicious. Apparently this is cookie camp. So every day this week he's learning a new cookie, which, oh my goodness. And then later today he's making muffins, I think. Cooking's one of Jacob's favorite things to do, so we put him in a lot of cooking classes. And camps now, apparently. Oh my goodness, Jake, those look delicious. So these are oatmeal M&M cookies. Yep. Mmm. 
taking a spot with an M&M. &M. That needs to be on our cookie party. They're so going to be. <laughs> Are they good? So good. Um. This is so good. Parker and I are working on a TikTok right now. If you can't tell, I always give those TikToks my all. We posted this up yesterday on our TikTok, so if you wanna see it, you can go see it right now. It's on TikTok. Our username is Ballinger Family. We have a lot of fun on TikTok. If you're not following us there yet, go follow us there. And if you're not subscribed here, subscribe here. Do all the things. It's just fun. We have fun. Do we have fun? Uh, probably. All right, we finished the TikTok. I'm back in my regular clothes. Um, you know what I mean. And Jacob is about to start his second baking class for the day. Oh, Bailey. I didn't know if you wanted to talk about it. You got stu stung by a bee. Yeah. Here you are in your silky pajamas. Feet yep. elevated. She stepped on a bee. I got the stinger out. Now she's just resting, trying to keep it from swelling, right? And learning French. And learning French. And reading books. Got and it. listening to, um, Aladdin Jr. music. Queen of multitasking. <laughs> so if any of you ever have a, a bee sting you, oftentimes the stinger will stay where it stung you. It'll stay in your skin. And you don't want to pinch that and pull it out because that will like inject the like the irritant that's in, in the, the back of the bee because that comes out with the stinger. So the best thing to do and what I did today is use a credit card and scrape the stinger out. It comes out pretty easily with that. I, I've always had success getting it out that way. And so if you've never done that before, that's that's my tip to you for the day. Use a credit card or any sort of like plastic card. It could be a library card. It could be a driver's license. Could be a guitar pick. You could maybe, maybe you could use, I've never tried that. Maybe you could use a guitar pick. Oh, Jacob, you've outdone yourself again. These are gingerbread muffins. They smell delicious. Now I've got to we might need these glaze for the cookie them. party, maybe. You're gonna glaze them? You've made a glaze? Yep. Oh, when I said you'd outdone yourself, that I was before you again outdone yourself. I want to see it. You want to see the muffins? Uh -huh. Okay, Which come here. Yeah, you can see the muffins. Can you see them? Oh. What do you think of those muffins? Mm -hmm. They Which look pretty good? Which one is mine? Uh oh. Oh well, no, that is oh, no. a little bit too much glaze. Yeah, it's got a, that one got a little bit much glaze. Why is the perfect for mine? This is so good. Mm. It's really good. And Jacob, what's the white stuff on top? Confectioner sugar. What's that? It's like a really fine sugar. Mm? Kind of like. Sugar, but it feels kind of like flour. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I taste that. Hi, let's talk about what we learned today. We learned that no nativity scene would be complete without an aggressively placed card. We learned the proper amount of cuticle cream to apply, less than Parker, much less than Parker. And finally, we learned that Bailey is the queen of multitasking. Thanks for watching, everybody. We'll see you next time. <laughs>